Hey there folks, Tango Tana here with a new look at Airport CEO Vintage Airlines. I think that's the name of the DLC. <laughs> anyway, yeah, so we're in my test airport, just so I can show you some of the, the new aircraft models that you get with a vintage DLC. I've already had a quick sneak peek, and they are very nice little models, I have to admit. So first of all, you get a new medium stand, which is this one here. So if we go into I believe, in the airports, in the parking, you can see it actually lists it as a separate stand altogether. Okay, and it looks ever so slightly different, and we've gone into nighttime. Fantastic. Well, hopefully, you know what, we might even be able to skip the day. Almost, yeah. So you can see it looks slightly different from the others here, which is quite nice. Now, the other thing you need to do is when you're trying to get vintage airlines in, you actually have to, there's a separate contract for them. So they've all got, you know, vintages. You got that one, and this guy here, and this guy here. Oh, and there's Nordic as well. Right, so we're going to pause. So we're just going to accept all of these as sort of a best chance scenario to get as many of these in as possible. Ooh, okay, air. Fantastic. I don't think there's any more. Let's quick scan through. No. So that should be all, pretty much all of them. Right. And I'm hoping that will... We got it. Um, oh, wrong button. If we go to here, if I have got these going, that's global. That's fine. These will set to computer. No. Why is that not selecting auto? Oh, auto plan. There we go. They're all auto planning. Perfect. So hopefully we'll start to get some of these airplanes in. We can have a little look. Make sure there's none that have crept in. No, nope, perfect. So we're going to do that. Wait for them to start coming in. And then we'll catch back up in a little while. Right, so we should have our first few landing any moment now. As you can see, we're starting to get some planned in already. So we have what we got oh yeah so the new planes we get is the douglas dc3 we have the lockheed l1049 i uh, got the de havilland comet which is quite a popular one that i know of you got the boeing 707 there's the boeing's 377 uh the vickers vc10 and there's a ford one trimotor i think it is something like that i can't remember i have written it down but i'll, I'll look later okay so oh, I don't actually know what we've got coming in here. It doesn't actually say, does it? Can you tell me that? SW, that doesn't help me. Nope. Uh, that doesn't help me either, no. Okay, so between all of these airlines, we should be getting most of them on. So we'll have a quick sneak peek, make sure we've got no other vintage ones pop up. Nope. So I just want to stay on this screen, so I want to watch them land. They should be coming in from this end here. Any second now. Here we go. So we're going to have two coming in quite closely together, and we'll see what we've got coming in. Let's have a look. Okay. Any minute now. This is a long waiting game now. So, yeah, yeah. How many? Six? Six, seven new planes, essentially. Which, yeah, I mean, they're only model assets, but, I mean, these devs have never let me down yet. So, you know, I don't mind supporting them. They've they've done well. Um, so, what have we got? How long was that plane lasting? Oh, any second now. I almost missed it. Here we go. Come on. It's worrying this bit. I was thinking, come on. Something's got to land. Something has to come in and land. Any sec. Oh, is the airport even open? Dashboard. Pause. That could be a slight issue. Stats. Wait. Dashboard. Operations. Here. Well, that would help, wouldn't it? That really would help. Hopefully, I've missed it. Okay, so let's just turn all of these on. Um, that's fine. Rampages. Oh, service ground disabled. Uh, yeah, we're just going to turn all of this on. Hopefully, I've not missed or messed anything up. Oh, I don't want G8. Right, come on. Oh, here it comes. Oh, we're coming in nice and slow. That looks quite nice. That is pretty nice, that. What is it? Let's zoom in a bit more. So this is... Let's pause. Does it tell me what plane it is? Mmm... -hmm. Manchester Douglas Mall Unknown DC3. There we go. So we've got our first DC3 come in. That's going to taxi to the end. And then we should have one of the others come in. I should have really put a different size runway in, shouldn't I? You know what? We can probably fix this. Let's keep it running. Go here, here. Um, we want the exit ramps, which is this guy. Let's go for large here. If I put it in, if I put multiple in, so one. Two. That should give them plenty of options to get off. 
two, three, perfect. And they, yeah, so we're all going to land there. That'd be cool. Okay, so that's the DC-3. What's this one here that's coming? This is probably a Comet 4. Now, the Comet, I think, looks quite nice because it has these lovely, weird jet engine intakes, which then swoop. And they run, run quite quickly, actually. <laughs> that's pretty cool. So, the DC-3 we've seen. We've seen the Comet. Wow, we're not doing bad. Oh, hang on. What's this? That looks nice. I like that. We'll have a look at all of these ones that are in the parking bays. That's just 377, was it? Which one was that one? Is this the... Oh, Strato Cruiser. That's what that one is. Okay, cool. So we're about halfway through. That is very nice. Oh. That I didn't realise. That they can use a non-vintage... I, I should have worked it out. That they can use the non-vintage... Um landing pads. So a little closer look at them. So that's the DC-3. If I remember correctly, the DC-3, wasn't that a transport plane during World War II? A, quite a popular one. I may be wrong, I should really do some research before I start wittering on. But that looks very nice. We've got the Comet. Again, I love these engine intakes. If you ever get to see, I don't think, is it a Comet that I've seen? I'm sure it is somewhere in a museum somewhere they've got a Comet. Um, but even when you see it in pictures, they look really nice. Oh, there's another one. Fantastic. Oh, look at that. Okay. <laughs> and then we've got the, the Boeing, what was it? 377 Strato Cruiser, which looks quite nice. It's four propellers. Cool. So we're going to skip ahead. Hopefully we'll get some new planes coming in. What have we got? It doesn't tell me. So what's this bad boy here? That's a 377 again. That's a Comet 4. Another DC-3. We've got any... Well, hopefully, everything else will start to come through quite quickly. It's an international one, mate. Maybe we need some more smaller pads? I wonder if that's part of the issue. Well, we're not getting any airplanes in anyway. So, yeah, I'll crack forward, and when we get the new ones in, a few of the other models, I'll let you have a little sneak peek of them. All right, see you in a second. Okay, and... Any second now, we should have the Ford TriStar. Wait. It's already landed. <laughs> well, there it is. <laughs> okay, that is a nice little cute little plane. How many does it carry? Which is that? Six. Okay, so it's a very small plane. Probably ones you wouldn't want in your airport initially, because it's probably not going to make you much money, I'll be honest, <laughs> with six passengers on board. Let's get rid of some of these. And um, if I'm read the things right we should have one of these and that's a comet 4 we've seen that one i think we've seen comet 4 yeah we have um we've got this 377 i don't think we've seen that one and the 707 i oh, know we've seen 3007 it's the 707 we've not seen that looks very nice at night oh oh i'm going too fast what is that that's a comet that looks very nice at night. I'm going a little bit quick. There's the the Boeing. Oh, that's a big plane. I kind of wish I wasn't running the game so fast. Let's slow it down. That must be the other one, the 707 then. Yeah. That looks very nice. With a little, you know, the much skinnier, old, um, I'll say old style. Still tur turbine engines, but the, the much skinnier. As you see. They look very nice. I, mean, I don't know. Do they jut out more than modern planes? Possibly. That's a nice little plane. That's probably one of the largest ones we've got in the game. With how many passengers? 134. So that's not bad. It's not bad capacity-wise. I like that. Okay, that's a good count. So they're the three big ones, essentially, aren't they? So that just leaves us waiting to see if we can get our hands on a Vickers VC-10. And... They haven't Comet. No, we've seen the Comet. It's the Lockheed Constellation is what we need to get our hands on. Ooh. Now, I don't actually know if that's a big plane or a little plane. I genuinely don't. So, skip ahead. See if we can work out which one of these, if any of these, is a Comet 4 again. That's a DC-3. Have we seen one? Yeah, we've seen them. We've got a Comet. 
We've got more comets. Oh, we've got plenty of them. Oh, there it is. VC10. Right. Can we reschedule that? Reschedule. Bring it forward. No, we can't. Really? Okay, that's international, so that's fine. Okay, that's not bad. For try, that's fine. I don't think we're going to get our hands on the Lockheed Tristar Super Consulate unless it's a fact. You know what? While we wait for that one, let's, let's have a little look. Back our, our contracts, uh, which is here. Who do any of these offer is that? So you don't. Don't you? No, you do. Okay, so this guy does. It's a medium airplane. You don't. Okay, so we might actually cancel that to give us a better chance of getting it in. Comet. Okay. You don't. So, so far, it looks like it's maple. You've got them. Okay. Tulip. And not this guy. Okay, so let's cancel that contract. What about you? You've. Do you do me a... Which one is it? It was the Lockheed Super something, wasn't it? L1049. So it's not that, so we can cancel that one for now. Let's cancel, cancel the planes running in flight. Yeah, okay. You've got 1049s. You haven't. Cancel that one. Yes. Okay, we can't cancel that. You've got 1049s. Okay, so we've got a couple of ones that we can't cancel. Can we cancel this one? Okay, uh, did it cancel? So that might give us a slightly better set of odds okay and we'll jump back when we see them all right guys and gals i shall see you in a second well i almost missed that one <laughs> it snuck in so here's the lockheed l1049 super constellation like yeah i completely missed it <laughs> landing but that's quite a nice little model as well so it's medium aircraft again i don't think we've got any large thing yet too small and the rest are all medium which is nice so i think that's a decent mix so the Comet 4 again, I believe. Am I getting them right? Wait. Can we click it? Yeah, Comet 4. Where? Hey. And I believe one of these should be the... Um, what's the other one? So it's the VC-10. The Vickers VC-10. I'm sure I've seen that one somewhere. Hang on. Have we got any of these with a VC-10? DC-3. Try for that's that one. VC10 is there, All right? So we've got that one. Can we reschedule it? Reschedule flight. Let's bring it forward. Okay, so I can't even bring it forward for some reason. Never mind. So that's the L. Yeah. Okay, and we've got no plans. Okay, so we're gonna wait a tad longer to get this VC10 in, so we can have a little look at that. Oh, it's gone. Oh, I was hoping to see it take off. <laughs> Never mind. Never mind. Not one bit. It will jump back and we'll have a little look at that one. Well, there it is. <laughs> it took time. Yeah, I kept missing it because I've run into that little bug where the flights... Yeah, anyway. Um, so, yeah, there it is. I've tried to put a few extra spotlights in to make it a little easier to see. Uh, but that is very nice with the four little engines at the back. I say little. They're quite big, I suspect. Compared to a comet next to it, I mean, what's the passenger count on this thing? 126 versus, can we see, yes, it's about three times the capacity, which is quite nice for a little plane. I say a little plane, still a decent sized one. I do like this, the tail. I don't know if you can see that well. Very nice. I don't think I've got any more landing in. I, like I said, I can't tell. Um, but yeah, there's a quick look at the new DLC and the newer planes you get. Um, as always, thanks for watching. Any comments, suggestions, leave them a bit below, and I shall see you folks next time. Take care. Tara.